Hey everybody, welcome back to What's Up Wednesday. Today we're making a card using the Starburst Sayings stamp set and the coordinating dies. And I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the uh, Oh Happy Day stamp. And I'm inking that up in um, with some Versamark ink so that I can do some heat embossing in a little bit here. So I'm inking that up and stamping it onto a piece of Whisper White cardstock. And I'm pressing down on it really well just to make sure that I get all the Versamark onto my cardstock. And then I'm taking a medallion um, stamp from that same stamp set and stamping that out twice in the Versamark. So once I have that um, stamped out, I'm gonna use some silver embossing powder and I'm just gonna go ahead and sprinkle that over my images there. And I'll just kind of shift that around on my uh, cardstock just to make sure everything gets covered and tap it out onto my piece of scrap paper. And I missed a little section, so I'm gonna go ahead and add additional um, silver embossing powder to that and then once I have that all tapped off I'm gonna go ahead and use my heat gun to melt that silver embossing powder and I really love the shine that comes out with that silver embossing powder so once I have that all heat set I'm gonna go ahead and use the coordinating dies that match the stamp set and stick those down using some washi tape just so I know that they're held in place you can also use the magnetic platform for this as well um, I'm just gonna go ahead and run those through my big shot and I'll be back to uh, start showing you my card base. So once I have those cut out, I'm gonna take a piece of black cardstock and using my trimmer, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this down to eight by eight and then do a score line at four inches. And that's gonna create my card base, which will be a four by eight card. I really like this size card and you can always make an envelope for this using your um, uh, envelope punch board. I'm gonna use some pattern paper from the Kaleidoscope uh, Designer Series paper. This is cut down to four inches by three inches and I'm just adding some adhesive to the back and adhering that down to the bottom half of my card. Using some of the black chevron ribbon, I'm kind of marking my area where I want my ribbon to come through and then I'm gonna take a uh, Gazacto knife and cut a little slit right into the um, fold of the card so that I can run my ribbon right through that fold. So you can see here I'm just kind of sticking it in and running it through and then I'm gonna go ahead and tie a simple knot around the uh, front of my card. I really love this chevron ribbon, it's so pretty. And there's so many different colors that you can get, but the black is probably one of my favorite colors. So once I have that um, knotted, I'm just gonna go ahead and use some scissors and trim off my ends. And then I'm ready to start putting my card together. Using the Oh Happy Day that I stamped out, I like this because it kind of reminds me of like a silver um, embossed sticker. So I'm adding some dimensionals to the back and I'm kind of adding a little extra because I know the cardstock got a little warped when I was doing the embossing. And then I'll go ahead and adhere that down. And then I'll take those two medallion pieces that I cut out and I'm gonna take one of them and put some adhesive on the back and kind of tuck that behind the Oh Happy Day sentiment. So I just tucked it right behind down towards the bottom, right, um, adhering it right to the card base. And then I'm gonna take my second one and put that down in the lower right hand corner. And then using one of those metal buttons that I used in my last video, I just went ahead and ran some floss through that, some uh, crochet floss. And then I will go ahead and just adhere this down. And I left the end sticking out from the outside or the bottom of the the button and I'll just go ahead and trim that off. So the last thing I want to do with this is round my bottom uh, left hand or right hand corner and top right hand corner and that's my card for today. I hope you enjoyed today's card. As always, a list of supplies will be in the description below or over on my blog. Thanks for watching and I'll see everybody next time.